Well, first at six, Columbia police are investigating after a body was found in a trash can behind a Columbia convenience store. Crime scene units were working on the scene this morning behind the Q Mart near the corner of Colonial and Academy Drive. Here's a look at that area where authorities discovered that body. WIS reporter Sam Shapiro joins us live from that location. So Sam, what have we learned so far? Yeah, that's right. I'm standing right where this body was found around this morning, just a few feet behind the QMAR to my left here. Columbia Police was called out here to Colonial Drive around 10 o'clock this morning after somebody found a body in a trash can right behind me here. Spokesperson from Columbia Police tells me the person is confirmed to be a female, but we have not received a name for this person yet. According to CPD, this is being considered a suspicious death at this point in the investigation. A woman who lives near the Q-Mart did not want to be identified. She says she saw people uncovering the body this morning while looking for food in the garbage. I walked across the street and I asked them what's going on. And they told me there was a body in the garbage can. So I asked them, how do y'all know a body's in the garbage can? So one of the guys said that he was looking in the garbage can for food. And that's when he saw a body. LaShawn Good is another person that lives near the Q-Mart who knew the person that was found. After seeing this person struggle, Good says she would help the victim by providing food and clothes. She was a very sweet person. Um, she was smart. She was smart. Um, she just, you know, was caught up in, you know, homelessness and drug addiction. Yeah, now at this time, a cause of death has not yet been determined. CPD also confirmed a person of interest was brought in for questioning, but a but that person is not a suspect. Reporting in Columbia, Sam Shapiro, WIS News 10. All right, Sam, thank you so much. Of course, this is a developing story. We will continue to provide updates on air and news as it breaks on WISTV.com. Thanks, Sam.